Lord, thank you in this giving praise and uplift you, Lord. And teach us how to call on your name, Father, in season and out of season. Because we have no season at all, Lord. Teach us how to call on your name. Let us not be in a place in life where we're so bored that we feel we don't need you. Because we always need you. We always need a word from you. So help us to call on your name. In the name of our Lord, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. If you're here today, and you don't know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, you don't know Jesus Christ at all, but you know now that if you call on the name of the Lord, He will be with you. You can be saved this day. If you don't know Jesus, now is your time. We will wait a few minutes as God works on your heart. You come forward, you give your hand, you give God your heart. We will pray the prayer of salvation with you. Or if you're here, if you don't have a church home, You've been going from place to place looking for the perfect place. The also perfect church because they're also perfect people. But if we do come here, we will pray with you and we will come to a fellowship like none other. And that is one of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So if you're here and don't have a church home, come in out of the rain.
with actions, I mean love. See, most would say it's me and you against the world. But with love, me and you can change the world. With me and you, there's no telling what we can do. We'll change lives. For everyone and everything that senses out, that senses us, feel our love is true. Love is a beautiful curse. Our love divided is the size of the universe. Combined the most love our God equals eternity. Always showing mercy. See, I'm willing to give to those who are living. If you think you're strong, let's see you try to break this bond. But you can't, because you can't. Even with the devil, you ain't going to be able. So get down or lay down, because our love will never faint. Worst thing is learn. Thank you very much for the house. I've been doing this for years.